many times when I was younger. Not that long ago, really. I used to love to sit on my father's lap and ask him to tell me stories of the old country. Unfortunately, it was a pained expression and more than the usual tint of red in his already ruddy complexion. He'd yell at me, Kevin Patrick, you're 17 years old. Get off my goddamn lap, you're hurting me. And I'd try to argue, Daddy, I love sitting on your lap while you drive. You used to even let me pretend to steer. But he just threatened me. A melody of curses, like a familiar folk tune. The rain of spittle and food particles, like the blessed oil and water itself, begging me to be baptized into some acknowledgement of maturity and my own body weight. One time, we were driving on Route 23, a particularly nasty, satanic coil of New Jersey highway, and I jumped on me father's lap with all the blushed joy of an illustrated child in a little golden book. Unfortunately, I was actually driving the car at the time, and I smashed Dad's car into the viaduct for Route 17, which happened to be passing overhead at that moment. Needless to say, I didn't get any of Mother's wonderful chili that night for dinner. Back home, even the dog seemed to scorn me. My father's hip has never been the same. And he never tells us stories of Ohio anymore. Never. Jackass. Smile.